adding ScumVM games. So first thing we're going to do is go into Pandori, ROMs, and then ScumVM. We're going to copy some of our ScumVM games into this folder. Goblins 2, Monkey 2, and Pajama Sam. Now we'll check out the ScumVM section on the Libretro website. It states we need a ScumVM file in the game directory. We can then go to the ScumVM compatibility page. This is a list of all the games that we can add to ScumVM. So our first game is Goblins 2, The Prince Buffoon. Highlight the game's short name and then copy. We'll now go into our Gob2 folder, right click on the free space, and then New, Text Document. And now open this document. On the first line, I'm going to right click and then paste. Save and then close this window. As we want box art to be in our playlist, we'll open up Pandora Thumbs and then find Goblins 2 within the ScumVM games. So we're going to select this, right click and copy. We need to rename this text document. Make sure we can see the file extensions in View, Show Hide, and tick this box. Now I can see it's a .txt file. We can right click, rename, select everything here, right click, and then paste. Then add .scumvm. If this pops up, hit yes, and that's Goblins 2 ready. Do the same for Monkey Island 2, as well as Pajama Sam. When I have female company, we are usually naked. Go into Settings, Playlists, Manage Playlists, Scum VM. And then Refresh Playlist. If we go to the Scum VM menu now, all of the games will be available with the box art. We can start them directly from here. To get to options, push start, or you can hold start to get back to RetroArch. If you'd rather use the native Linux version, go to applications and scroll down to ScumVM, and then run. We now need to add our games to this list. Click on this down arrow, and then mass add. Hit yes. Now we need to guide ScumVM to our games folder. Go into Munt, Pandori, ROMs, ScumVM, and now click Choose, and then OK. Now we can start any of these games by selecting one and pushing Start. On the A500 Mini Controller, we can push Home to get to this menu, and then return to Launcher. If you want to change video or sound options, click a game and then options. If you want to fill the screen or have pixel perfect scaling, we can faff with the settings here. So now Pajama Sam can look great in a full screen and no longer be afraid of the dark. Things usually get more fun with the lights turned off, with a nice cup of tea and Beverly in her bikini.